Hello YouTube and LEGO fans and welcome to Destination LEGO. Okay, so here we have the clone turbo tank from the winter 2014 theme range. So this is obviously from the new Microfighters um, range of LEGO Star Wars sets. Um, so this is set 75028. Age of 6 to 12, comes with a piece count of 96 pieces, retails here in the UK for £8.99. Okay guys, first off, let's see our box there, front of the box. For those of you who are interested, there's the rear of the box. Um, manual, one of the smaller size manual sets obviously, being a microfighter set. Rear, inside. Inventory piece count, we have a total of 29 pages of build. Right, so there we go, there's our first look at the clone turbo tank from this Microfighters range. As per my previous videos, and please look down in the description to this video, um, and there should be a link to all the other Microfighters sets as well, or certainly the ones that I've reviewed. Um, and if I haven't done so already, as and when I upload more, I will put the links down to those too. Um, again, my opinion on these microfighter sets, I think these are very good actually. Um, these are obviously a replacement for the planet sets, which were okay in their time. I wasn't a massive fan of those, but these, I think they have a lot more detail um, on the actual sets themselves. Obviously come with a minifigure, which is a great addition. Um, great little fun set, and like I said, a lot of detail on these. Okay guys, so first up, let's uh, take a look at the minifigure. Okay, so included in this set is a clone trooper. As we can see here now, so he comes with this blaster. Standard blaster, so let's just take that, remove that so we can take a closer look. Um, standard clone trooper, so you can see there the front leg printing down into the front torso. Obviously that helmet detail and printing. Round onto the rear of the torso there. Um, remove his helmet and obviously the standard clone um, printed face. You can see there it is obviously single sided. Okay, guys, so that is our clone trooper. Right, so next up, I'm going to give you a quick 360 tour of the turbo tank itself. Okay, so let's just take a spin round of the turbo tank. It's moving round slowly. You can see there, obviously, that side view. All those wheels, looking awesome. Moving round to the rear. See some of that rear detail. And again, round to that other side there. Good look at the front. And finally back round to that side shot. Okay guys, next thing I want to point out on this, again, it really does add to this set really. Um, but these wheels are not just fixed, they do obviously rotate, so you can drive this along. So obviously makes for obviously some additional great playability um, with regards to this set. Okay, so let's just take a closer look at some of these functions and details on this set. Again, there you can see all those um, wheels. Right, so up in the top here is our space for our clone trooper. The little cab area there, um, where he can obviously sit and control the turbo tank. Okay, a bit more of a spin round. Look at the underside. And that rear detail and the only other feature on this um, like with all the other microfighter sets just come with flick fire missiles so on this one you can see they are one there and on the other side another one there and as with all these you simply flick it out I'll just push that out for the time being you can see it standard flick fire missile there with the translucent blue cone piece on the end so simply flick or push out like so to fire the flick fire. Okay, so far the thing that we can obviously do with the turbo tank is take the clone trooper, 
put them in his cab like so he just simply slots in there and we can obviously push him down so that he's held in there um, so there we can now see the clone trooper obviously piloting or driving the clone turbo tank Right, there we go, that's my review of this set complete, the LEGO Star Wars Clone Turbo Tank from the Microfighters um, wave of sets, this being the first wave, winter 2014, um, like I said this is set 75028. Okay guys, please go ahead and leave me a thumbs up if you did like this video, as always leave any comments, feedback, questions down in the comments section, and if you haven't done so already, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel, and I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Cheers!